Hey, this is Firestarter, and welcome back to Let's Play Distant World Shadows. Now, I explained at the end of the last video that there is a empire here called the Abrogado San Alliance that is suddenly way too close to me. I have the colony influence thing on right here, and yeah, they're right in the middle of my empire here. Is that them over here as well? No, that's the boss, Kara. So, my focus right now is Dactarians. I'm going to push onto these two colonies, and then I'm going to push out. And in the same time, I'm trying to establish myself in the middle of the galaxy map here. Obviously, you can see that that could be a, a good strategic uh, point to have. All right, so let me go ahead and unpause this. So my troop ships over here. Before that, though, let's go ahead and take out that spaceport. That's a big loss for them. Alright, my uh, troop ships are on their way. Attack 1 is about halfway here. Let me go ahead and build a defensive base down here if I haven't already started one. Doesn't look like it. figured that was going to happen. They just declared war on us. And there is a hidden pirate base here. And we also just took this planet. Still concerned about the pirate base though. Alright, this is Sondaire 5. So same thing here, I'm just going to leave three of these guys behind, let them garrison, and pick the rest up. Also, build a defensive base to deal with any pirate threats. Maybe even the Akdarians. Alright, you guys will come up here and blockade. Take care of any spaceports if they have any. Let's go ahead and target their colony. Source, so this is a pretty decent planet, 73% quality. Liking what I'm seeing over here. Would you like to buy some uh, technology from us? Advanced troop transport for 355,000. No. 
What kind of technology do you have, though? And what can I trade? I can end my war with the Hakonish for one million and pick up some technologies. But I don't I don't want to do it. I have long term goals down there. Wait a minute. We're having some problems here. So that's what this Abrogado Sand Alliances. We lost this planet because they revolted against us. Let me take a look at my colony screen here. What the hell is going on? These guys aren't very happy. Let's lower the tax a bit. Let's see if we can get the happiness to plus 15. tax below that, below 15%, that's just crazy. These guys aren't getting taxed at all. What's going on with my leader? Where is he? government. We have monarchy, war weariness, minus 30%. Interesting. Well, I think right after I take this colony, I might be pushing for peace and I gotta take care of my own stuff over here. Scientist, uh, have been pursuing the wrong path while researching unlimited commerce. Are you kidding me? We were almost done here. We we're at 90 something percent. That is ridiculous. Alright. I really need these wars to end pretty quickly. Um, let's talk to the Actarians. Oh, they they actually want to fight, so that's that's completely fine. We'll fight. Garrison those troops. Let's check out attack one. How far or how close are they to their target? They're pretty damn close. Attack two. We're gonna come over here and blockade. Attack four. Send them out over here. Start pushing into their territories until they want to uh, have peace. So I have a lot of things going on right now. I'm taking care of the Darians, the Hakonish down here, trying to get a good footing, and taking care of the rebels up here. My attacking fleet just arrived. Good opportunity to load up my troops. Where's attack one going? Thank <laughs> you. 
I'm gonna try to end the war with the Hakonish as soon as I uh, demolish everything here, pretty much. And look, they're going solo. That's what I didn't want them to do. They're gonna get picked off one by one over here, doing that. Oh really? You're gonna send me a gift? Uh, you just revolted or rebelled against me? All right, Troop One has 32 troops. We're gonna send them here right now. attack each other anyway, just too far logistically. And yeah. This is why it sucks to have allies sometimes. Why are you guys escaping? I'm pretty sure I have you guys set not to escape. I'm not sure what's going on over here. Yeah, he's escaping. <laughs> the strongest ship in my fleet. Okay, I'll bring a move order over here. I do not want them engaging the spaceport over here yet. Check it out, they're going to engage anyway, you know what, let's just go ahead and do it. I'm going to lose my fleet because of this, I don't understand why I can't keep them here. I mean, I'm set on manual. Yeah, oh man, I can't believe that, I'm going to lose my entire fleet. and a repair order. Alright, back to what's going on up here. What's going on with this fleet? They have a pretty decent sized fleet over here. Let's go ahead and engage them. Oh, check that out. They have a lot going on over here. Escorts, freighters. See, I had to reload the autosave, and um, I have my ambassadors just sitting here now, so I have to kind of work them in again. So I'll send one to this uh, Securing Utopia. We have a minus seven reputation right now. We don't want to lose our free trade agreement. So we'll send one to Utopian Paradise. Not seeing it on the list here. 
Oh wait, that's the government. Starts with them. It's made up. There we go. Diplomacy minus 10%. We have plus 23% trade income though, so that works out. Alright. We want to increase the relationship with these guys at Ennen because we have a decent relationship and they probably don't want a free trade agreement yet. No. So let's see if we can get one going with them. want a free trade agreement. No deal. Let's send one to Exudin, if that's how you pronounce it. I have one more ambassador just waiting around, so... How about the Naparis? There we go, we're all set there. What's going on over here? The Hakonish is back. I'm kind of in trouble here. I couldn't get my fleet to listen, I did not want them to <laughs> engage that planet, but here we are. This thing right here might have to be put on hold. Do they have troop transports in this fleet? We don't know, but they have uh, destroyers which might have... Uh, troop modules, we don't know. How far away are we from taking this planet over here? We have it actually, it's ours. I'm gonna do something I really don't want to do, but I kind of have no choice, and that's to uh, get peace with these guys. They're down to two colonies. In their eyes, they have no choice. In our eyes, just because of logistics, they were probably taking this planet. No way in hell were they going to uh, take this other planet back. I have way too many troops here. But um, I can work with two planets over here. Eventually, I'm going to take the system. I'm, I will take this planet. I have enough troops sitting here right on this planet. This is enough troops. Yeah, okay, so I, I think I made the right decision there. I will come back to this. Now what's going on up here? getting owned up here. Looks like I'm gonna have to create some more ships. Some cruisers. Queued up 20 destroyers, 10 cruisers. Oh, 
don't know, I'm gonna try something here. What is that planet called? It starts with a U. Trade section supposed by the uh, hack one ish. Really? You're gonna play that game now? That's fine. I'm gonna leave four experienced uh, battle bots. Let's go ahead and load up some troops. I mean, if they're gonna do that to me right after going peace, um, I'm not gonna be very nice to them either. Let's just put it that way. Thousand troops. That's a lot. Is this a pirate? Yeah, shit. Land the troops. here let's go ahead and send them a ref repair or fuel order I'm gonna have to send them or you know what I'll just send them over here I'll build a battle bot uh, troop foundry facility Attack 4 is doing. They still have 7 ships here. I'm not sure what exactly they're doing. It's like they're uh, hiding me right now. Yeah. Let's just go after, uh... I don't know. Some mining stations. A ton of them here in this uh, asteroid field. Select some military ships. Ten destroyers. Oh, you know what? destroyers or 20 destroyers and 11 cruisers put them in a new fleet every single one of them attack 5 we're going to overwhelm them Actually, let me tell them to stop. Send them a prepare and attack order. There we go. Some of them need fuel and all that. And let me check my colonies real quick. Some of them should start uh, to be a little bit more happier. species, and then tired of wars, and then resource shortages, probably because they're, the, they're just so far away. Who else am I at war with? These guys.
I think my defensive base over here got destroyed by an intelligence agent. I didn't really get to uh, read the whole thing there. And I'm going to end this session right here. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and take care.